meaning of depreciation depreciation meaning depreciation is the permanent continuous and gradual decrease in the book value of fixed asset due to wear and tear passage of time obsolescence a flux of time accidents fall in market price etc in short student depreciation means diminishing or reduce in the value of fixed asset features or characteristics of depreciation it is a decrease in the book value of fixed asset number one number second it is non cash in reality we don't pay for decrease in the value of asset it goes itself it is a non cash expenditure next it is a revenue loss it is not non recurring it is recurring causes for depreciation number one wear and tear of an asset due to its continuous use in production next permanent fall in market price permanent fall in market price last one passage of time next is need for charging charging depreciation need for charging depreciation why we need depreciation why we should find out depreciation number one to find out the correct profit or loss for the for a certain period that means to know the accurate profit or loss we need depreciation next to replace the asset at the end of its life factors to be considered before charging depreciation cost of the asset number 1 estimated life of the asset the scrap value of the asset interest on investment on asset methods of charging depreciation following are the methods of depreciation straight line method student we have a different name also for this original cost method a uh, book value method fixed installment method next diminishing balance method we have other two names reducing balance method return down value method third one annuity method fourth one revaluation method fifth one depreciation fund method and last one insurance policy method meaning of straight line method other way original cost method or fixed installment or book value method under this method a fixed and equal amount is written off as depreciation at the end of each year during the lifetime of the asset is called fixed installment or original cost or straight line or book value method merits of straight line method what are the advantages of this method it is very simple to understand and easy to calculate second one the burden of depreciation on profit and loss account is equal or uniform for all years demerits or disadvantages this method ignores the interest on investment on the asset and this method does not provide for the replacement of the old asset that is two drawbacks